Hey guys, what's going on? It's your crack and sudden death here. Come at you guys with another Call of Duty Black Ops 3 gameplay. Today I got another gameplay from DN Beats. He's using the CUDA SMG and playing on the map Nuketown. He goes 53 and 6, uh, gets over half the points for this TDM. He's using the Vision Pulse Specialist, and Division Pulse Specialist is my favorite specialist to use in Nuketown and small maps like Combine, Nuketown. Uh, trying to think of another one it's good to use on but those are my favorite maps uh, Skyjacked um, those are the favorite maps I like using Vision Pulse on it's just terrific I also would recommend using Gravity Spikes on this map as well guys what I want to talk about today is Nuketown being moved into the normal playlist uh, for map rotations or whatever the hell you call it okay so now when you go into a game you can find like just a basic TDM you can find the map Nuketown now. Now, I like this and I don't like this. I like it now that, you know, I Nuketown will come up. I don't have to play, you know, a Nuketown specific playlist or go into the bonus playlist to play Nuketown. But what I don't like about this is how many times I'm playing Nuketown now. Whether it is, it's like Combine, how it used to be. Combine popped up every single time and then people can vote for it. Again, I have played a lot of Nuketown in the past few days of playing COD, and I've really played since, you know, I got Black Ops 3 uh, four months ago. Um, you know, it's so over the past week, I've played Nuketown a lot, and it's just getting a little annoying amount, the amount of times Nuketown pops up, and everybody votes for it. I mean, everybody except myself votes for Nuketown, and I, I, I don't know how I really feel about this, or I, I do know how I feel about this. I really think it should be taken out. Uh, I don't, you know, I don't really understand why Treyarch did this and put Newtown into the normal map rotation. I think it's kind of stupid, because uh, now, you know, you're dealing with the people wanting to vote for Combine and then the people wanting to vote for Newtown. So you get a big situation where, you know, you get your team that really sucks and is on a small map versus a big map and you just get totally annihilated uh, by a much better team. So that's just my experience with the new town uh, being moved into the playlist, the basic playlist. Let me know what you guys think of it in the comment section down below. Do you guys think new town should be in the normal playlist or should have had a playlist of its own? You know, maybe you have like a, a DLC map playlist. You know, we can have the Awakening and the new town if you bought it or, you know, I don't, I don't know how it's going to work or maybe have new town as a lower chance of being, you know, I don't know what's the percentage chance of, you know, having a map picked up, uh, but have Nuketown significantly lower, maybe, uh, in the basic playlist, or something like that, or only being allowed to play Nuketown once in the playlist for every, I don't know, eight matches or something like that. Again, guys, I'm just throwing out uh, some ideas. Don't know what it actually worked, but I hope they do fix this, because... Nuketown does get a little bit annoying. Anyways, guys, I hope you do enjoy the rest of this gameplay. Beats does go 53 and 6. Like I said, just totally annihilating the other team with this Kuda. Kuda, such a good gun. Such a good gun. Anyways, guys, Dirk Station console recruitment did end. Um, so if you guys signed up, uh, I've chosen a couple guys already and already sent out emails. So if you guys uh, have did sign up, make sure you guys check your emails. I'll be sending out a couple more emails here in the next couple of days. And you guys can go ahead and uh, go through the testing period. And we'll go from there. Anyways, guys, this is your cracker, sudden death here, signing out. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.